This is truly a vision to revolutionize what we can do with an inland towboat. The project started three years ago, a lot of hard work, a lot of expertise, but we have put together the most efficient, high-performing inland vessel built in generations. We're really excited about this new tugboat because it's the first inland hybrid tugboat. And what that means is that it can run on battery power. It will significantly reduce the emissions that you would normally see. And it's a big step forward to reducing emissions for Kirby and the marine infrastructure. The Green Diamond is really the first of its kind. It gives the world a proof point and it gives us here in the inland industry a proof point that you can actually decarbonize North American and Jones Act towboat industry. I'm really honored that we're all here today to celebrate this collaborative effort. And I just want to thank everyone who has worked so hard to get us here today. We got an email notification saying that they were gonna run a naming contest. I was in the car with my wife actually uh, while, she, while she was driving and I said, oh, we, we can name a boat. And she said, oh, it should be something with a, with a gemstone. She loves jewelry and rocks and stuff. So we came up with Green Diamond and the rest was, was that. Christening a vessel dates back to the Phoenicians and the ancient Greeks. And the purpose of that was to ask God or the God's blessing and safety for the vessel itself and as importantly for the crew. And that remains as true today as it did back then. In the name of God and the people gathered here today, we name this vessel and christen this vessel, the motor vessel Green Diamond. It takes many entities to do something this special. You know, within Kirby Corporation, we have Kirby Marine, Stuart and Stevenson, and San Jack Marine all working together to develop and build the Green Diamond vessel. The Green Diamond is the pinnacle of our ESG initiatives. And now here today, it's come to fruition and it's something that makes a difference and will really reduce our carbon footprint. So we're excited about this boat and we're excited for the next one. It will operate here in the Houston Harbor, given its wonderful environmental benefits to citizens of Houston, which we're also very proud of.